Holy shit. Yeah. Oh, am I supposed to say that? And as usual, it's my first time tasting this. Season Infinity was in cab saw barrels for two years. Holy shit. Yeah. Oh, am I supposed to say that? Holy beep, it's Christmas time. This is unfiltered goodness. Yeah, Taylor, oh my god, the oak quality, big fruity blast, it's taking me back. Everyone who loved Narrows, in between. And you got the tannin from the oak, from the wine, from the currants themselves, sort of mysterious fruit, not something we're sprinkling on all of our muesli in the morning, right? This smells expensive. This is an incredible, really sophisticated, fantastic hybrid. The world of beer, the world of wine, um, the old world and the innovation of the American new world, where brewers have been and where they're heading, the modern and the ancient, you know, the wood and the steel, the paradox that something that takes this much patience, this, this well aged can also taste so incredibly fresh and vibrant. That's like such a fun little mystery to get wrapped in when enjoying and contemplating and sharing these beers. Like the, the, the tart fruit, the oak, the base of the beer, the interplay of all the cultures, and the ghost of whatever wine was in the barrel there. It's, like, it's there like this little kiss. You know, but you can't, it doesn't taste like wine. It tastes like, it, just, it tastes like itself. It doesn't taste like any of the parts. It doesn't taste like anything you've ever had, or maybe to some extent that anyone in history has tasted until fairly recent history. It sounds like a lot to say, but it really is something to, to just even sit and smell and taste this. It's like zooming out and seeing this whole picture. Wow, even that first sip, I could taste it for minutes. Amazing.